becoming a qa manager was one of the biggest goal when i was starting out my career as a automation tester or a normal software tester right so if you know or if you have already seen in the last video i discussed about how in within a span of 3 year i was able to become a qa lead right now i'm going to talk to you about how i was able to become a qa manager within a span of almost 7 8 years right how you can do it too and what are the five important steps that you can do if you are already a qa lead how you can become a qa manager what are the skills that you should have what are the things that you need to pay attention very short videos but i'm going to give you a very practical tips that help me i hope this that will help you too also right so step number 1 is manager is all about how you handle the people right this is one of the important learning that i have so here is a story of great contributor weak contributor and the help you are from this right what do you mean by this pramod see so when you are a manager right there are there are certain people who will be great contributor for example suppose there are five people assigned to you right two of them will be very great contributor they can work alone they don't need your help but there are three people who will need your help they stop their work whenever they are blocked like right? they have lot of challenges so when you become a manager right this is all about how you handle them right what i have learned is that what whoever is a great contributor right they can deliver their task very very well but there are the people who i have three people who basically face issue related to blocking right they are blocked because of some team members they don't they don't have any idea how to process how to do what are the steps they don't have a bigger picture right so as a manager what you need to do is you have to help them more that right? this is the most important thing that you need to remember the people who are weak contributors or weak in the overall team right you have to help them more as a manager this is one of the important learning right as a manager you are responsible for their growth their career right their overall objective what as a team they deliver that's the most important thing that i have learned right do you have a coding fear and you think that okay java is something which is very difficult to learn then python is exactly the language where you can start your automation journey guys if you are a fresher manual tester who wants to jump into the automation automation is a need of the hour so make sure that you are becoming an automation and you are learning and adding the skills related to automation into your profile so job ready automation tester with python is basically getting started where we are going to cover python api testing and selenium in the 3 months of span we, i am assuming that you are basically a beginner total beginner and you are we are going to crack with the live projects okay check out the link below which is how to become a job ready automation tester all right in 3 months I'll see you. Step number two is help others and delegation task. Guys, this is the one of the important skill that I have learned. If you are a manager, you have to delegate the task. Delegate the task basically means, for example, if suppose there is a project given to us that okay, here is the website that you need to test. As a manager, your responsibility is that you should know and you should ask the team and let them know and ask more and more question. Okay, how much time it will take? What are the resources will be there? How you are going to do? Who is going to do what? Decide and delegate the task properly. As a manager. Manager, this is one of the important learning. If you are failing on this, overall project will fail, and you will be the first person where people will, team will say that okay, developer, even developer, product manager will say that okay, you are a QA manager and you are not able to deliver the test cases, not able to execute the test cases within the timeline. So you are completely, completely depend upon your company or contributors how they basically delegate. So learn the art of delegation. That's the most important thing. How to delegate a task, right? For example, if you are a great contributor, I will give you this task. if you are a weak contributor i will give you this task so that my project is not at risk this is what the manager will do third number is take more initiative guys manager is all about leader first of all before you are a manager you are also a leader right you are a leader who will basically help the team to lead right so make sure not everyone in your team will have the idea about efforts who is going to do what what are the problems we are going to face other things and everything right how we are going to deliver so much so much things within a span of scrum scrums and everything right so you have to take Take initiative. You should be the go-to person from the team, right? You should be the go-to person who will basically properly communicate with the team that okay, this is the time we will take. This is the resources. This is where we are working. This is the Excel sheet we are tracking. Let other people know that okay, this is where the everything is there. Visibility point of view, you have to basically do and use the power of delegation. Delegate the time as well as the work smartly so that it is it is delivered before time if possible. That's the important thing that you should learn. This is what what I have learned. They should look for you, right? As a manager, this is very very important because i remember when uh, there was a very bad manager right and i was not the person who will look into that manager because i knew that person didn't have any manager skill right but right now what i what, what i have seen is that as a manager other people will also look for you okay promote sir this is what we are delivering is it fine so you can verify peer review you can unblock them meal make them feel comfortable talk to them right whatever they are delivering you can help them right all your things you can basically do but remember the most core funda of a manager which 
विच इज पावर ऑफ डेलीगेशन पावर ऑफ अनब्लॉकिंग पावर ऑफ गिविंग क्लैरिटी पावर ऑफ डिलीवरिंग पावर ऑफ टेकिंग इनिशियटिव दिस इज ऑल दीज फैसिलिटी ऑफ ए मैनेजर एज ए मैनेजर यू शुड हेल्प दम इन देअर करियर इन देअर डिलीवरी इन देअर वट एवर दे वॉन्ट टू अचीव दे शुड फील कम्फर्टेबल वेन एवर दे टॉक टू यू राइट दिस इज द मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट थिंग एंड प्लीज इन दी एंड विच इज द फोर्स्ट फाइव इंपॉर्टेंट वन राइट यू डोंट हैव टू प्रोवाइड दम सो मच लिबर्टी दैट दे डोंट फील रिस्पॉन्सिबल सो इफ देर इज अ प्रोजेक्ट दैट वी नीड टू डिलीवर विद इन अ टाइम दे दे शुड फील रिस्पॉन्सिबल सो यू हैव टू स्कोल्ड दम ऑल्सो वाई यू आर ब्लॉक्ड हैव यू ट्राइड दिस हैव यू ट्राइड दिस हैव यू टॉकिंग दिस हैव यू रेज दिस वाई यू हैव नॉट एक्सकेलेटेड यू हैव टू टॉक टू दम ऑल्सो एंड इफ पॉसिबल जस्ट स्कोल्ड दम ऑल्सो राइट वाई यू आर ब्लॉक्ड फॉर दिस थ्री डेज टू डेज वट एवर इट इज राइट ऑल दीज आर बेसिकली थिंग्स दैट आई हैव लर्न एंड दिस इज हाउ यू बिकम फ्रॉम ए क्यू एल ई टू क्यू ए मैनेजर आई होप यू लर्न समथिंग न्यू दीज आर थियोरिकल कॉन्सेप्ट बट द मोर दिस इज वट आई हैव लर्न प्रैक्टिकली वेन आई वॉज डूइंग इट राइट आई होप दिस विल हेल्प यू दीज फाइव पॉइंट्स आई गोन शेयर राइट सो लेट मी रिएट्रेट विच इज पावर ऑफ डेलीगेशन टेकिंग मोर इनिशियटिव विजिबिलिटी हेल्पिंग योर टीम हेल्पिंग इन दियर करियर हेल्पिंग दियर इन दियर मनी दियर वट एवर दी वॉन्ट अनब्लॉकिंग दैम टेकिंग इनिशियटिव एंड गिविंग दी क्लैरिटी वट टू डिलीवर दिस इज द मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट थिंग एज ए मैनेजर यू कैन डू राइट दिस इज वट आई हैव लर्न ऑलमोस्ट ट्वेल्व ईयर्स एक्सपीरियंस राइट थैंक्स फॉर फॉर वॉचिंग प्लीज टाइप इन द चैट इफ यू नीड मोर हेल्प आर यू ए क्यू ए लीड और क्यू ए मैनेजर जस्ट गिव मी येस इन द चैट एंड आई सी यू थैंक्स फॉर फॉर वॉचिंग 